we're back with the case study of vanitas we're getting into the end game we only got a couple of episodes left i mean the the winter 2022 anime season is is going to be over so i will be working on my video for the next anime coming next season but we're here for the case study of vanitas we have some big stuff happen last episode dominique is dealing with i'm guessing the next villain of this arc we got Vanitas over here, you know, head over heels over Jean. So what's going to happen this episode? I don't know. So let's go ahead and jump in and find out because I got a feeling it's about to get intense. My subtitles, man. He, he, what did it say in there? Uh, yo, when... I'm sorry, but when you get Mika, Mikao, Mika, Mikael, Michael, yeah, when you get when you get hair on a letter, that ain't good. And I'm I'm guessing that's Dominique's, right? Dummy, yep. Yep, yep, yep. She's in trouble. Big, big trouble. Guessing this dude is going to uh, manipulate Noe in some way. I want I want to know what he he wants to do with Noe. Again, there's that doctor, right? I, I believe that was his his nickname or whatever. It's a really mysterious person. Now, if I uh, if I remember correctly, he was um, he was affected by the uh, he was a curse bearer, right? Curse bearer, yep. This is the whole showdown that happened at the church. Uh it went down at the church. Yep. This this scene was uh was awesome. Of course, we, we know so much more now about everything that happened, right? When it comes to the curse bearers. Because if I understand correctly, the queen of vampires is the one that's corrupting all these different vampires by, you know, uh, stealing their true name and thus making them curse bearers, right? Ooh, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. I remember this. I remember this. That was the doctor, right? The fact that they're still hiding his face says something. That's the, uh, yep, full of stakes. A psychological condition. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. What, after what he saw? Yeah. Oh, interesting. I'm, now I'm wondering, because last episode we saw Dominique. She had the red eyes, which, you know, she was kind of like 
eating people, right? So I'm guessing she became a curse bearer. I wonder if this is the moment that it happened. Nope, never mind. Because, you know, we know when somebody's helpless, that's usually when they become vulnerable to charlatan, right? So I wonder if this is the moment for her. Damn, she's cold. Wow, who is this? Veronica. You gotta chill. Look at the way she's looking at her. Bro, she crazy. Bro, she is evil. What? I mean, they did have the same color hair. I wonder if Louise uh, knew this. Wow. So he was probably experimented on. Oh, this lady, Veronica, look at this. Now she's over here teasing her as well. Damn, bro. Evil. I'm telling you, this is the moment. This is the moment that Charlatan probably reached out to Dominique and, and corrupted her. This has to be it. Mm, damn yeah so that probably means that Louise did know the truth where did where did Veronica go she disappear damn no he did Oh, there it is. There it is. Yeah. I feel like that's like charlatan breaking in right now. Just giving in. Oh, wow. Look at her. Look at her eyes. She just looks done. Depressed. Yeah, she's going through it right now. That Veronica really did a number on her on her head, especially after the events of the church. What was that? Yeah. 
Big how? Dude, this dude is suspicious. This dude is definitely suspicious. Wait, was that the book of Anita's? So he does he have some sort of connection with Dominique? Damn, even to this day, Dominique feels guilty about this. I don't trust this guy, man. Like, like he, like, how can I, how can I put it? Like, oh, he's pissed off. But yeah, this Mike Hill, whatever his name is, Mike Hill, uh, th these names are way too complicated for me. Uh, like, he seems so nice that it seems evil. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, man. I, I don't know why he wants to lure Noe out here. Bro. What the, what? Make hell, make hell. Does he know him? He's alive. How, how, how does he have a book? Big how. That doesn't make any sense. So there are two books of Vanitas? Bro, he's exactly like Vanitas. Wait. Is that the other kid that was with Vanitas whenever the original Vanitas rescued him? I, my theory was that that was Noe and Noe didn't remember. So I guess that's this guy. Because he has the same color hair. I, I thought, oh, maybe that's baby Noe. And, you know, he just doesn't remember. Interesting. Things got way more interesting right now. And again, I always love to credit the music. The music right now is setting the tone. Like that mysterious tone to this character. Is he evil? Is he good? Does he have a good relationship with Vanitas? And, uh... So he's after Noah's ability. Bro, I'm loving this! Cause this is like a like Vanita's past catching up to him right now. I love Mike Hill, bro. Like he's a, he's a bastard. He's evil. He's manipulating people, and I don't think he's using the book the way it's intended. Maybe I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But wow, what an introduction to uh, 
I'm guessing the next villain, right? He's not he's not doing heroic things right now. I wonder if he's actually doing the same thing that Vanitas is doing. Like if he's going around rescuing vampires. Uh I don't know. It does the way he's using the book against Dominique. It don't seem like it. Right? I'm guessing she's like this because of him. Because of Mike Hill. Mike Mike I mean, I'm, not, I'm telling you, man. I'm struggling with the names right now. Bro, he acts so innocent. Like, I just don't trust him at all. I hate to say it. Really don't. We know the ultimatum that Vanitas gave Noe. Bro. What are you doing? Bro, you don't need to do all that. Wait, he said a she? Yes, okay, yes, 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 yes. Do it. Do it. Come on, Noe. We need to. We need to learn. We need to learn what's going on with uh, Vanitas and his past. Looks exactly like Luis. Bro, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. There we go. There we go. I mean, they're, they're, they're a little extra with the feeding scenes. Right, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, he said she. Wait, wait, did I miss that? Is, did he switch? Okay, she or should I say he is the child who survived? Uh, wait, is that a she or a he? Or is it one of those cases? Oh. Damn. So it was, it's a he, but the mother was dressing him as a she to sell him. Is that Roland? Yo, how old is Roland? <laughs> of course, typical Roland. Oh, I love you, man. We need more screen time with Roland. But this is... Ooh... So now the question is, does Roland know that the doctor was experimenting on children? Wow.
Bro, he is traumatized. <laughs> what well, I mean, like, come on now. Oh damn! Who? What, I'm guessing that was the doctor, right? Man, I really hope that Roland. Was not doing this. Like I hope. Like I hope Roland didn't know about this. Right. Because that's messed up. If Roland was willingly giving children to this guy to experiment on. Is that it? There's no way. You gotta be kidding me man. All right, man, yo, this, this, like, the case study of Anita just keeps getting better and better. Uh, so, episode 21, and I believe on my last video, somebody left a comment saying that this is going for 24 episodes. So, three more episodes after this. Uh, and I'm guessing they're gonna be, they're gonna be big, because it seems like we are going to dive deeper into Vanita's past. We see that this Mike Hill, whatever his name is, he is connected to Vanitas. And we have seen the flashback of whenever the vampire, the original Vanitas, rescued uh, all the children from that place. And essentially, we saw in the flashback that Vanitas was with another kid that had, you know, white hair. And now we know that was Mike Mike Hill or Mike Micah Hill. I don't know. His, you know who I'm talking about. Uh, but my theory was that that was no way. Um, you know, I was kind of like, I, I thought that was going to be like a little plot twist that maybe somebody altered Noe's memories. And, 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 you know, maybe that's why Vanitas was hanging around with Noe. Like maybe he knew where to find him and everything. Like maybe everything about Noe's life was constructed by Vanitas and the original Vanitas and all that stuff, right? Like that, I feel like that, that was probably the way that they were going, but it seems like they're going on a whole different direction because now, as we know, my theory was completely wrong. I mean, it wasn't even close. Uh, I was literally just looking at the white hair and I'm like, Ooh. Ooh, you know what I mean? Like that looks mighty close. Like no way. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, that's completely uh, wrong in that situation. Now the question that we do have to ask is one: Why did Vanitas killed Vanitas? Right? Why would their father? Why did he do that? It seems like Mike, my, Michael. I'm just gonna call him Michael. It, it seems like he wants freaking answers. Right? He wants to know what happened between Vanitas and and their father, uh, and it seems like Vanitas is not telling them. So there has to be some sort of secret there, right? My theory, of course, will have to be that whenever Vanitas did what he did, it was probably because their father wished it, right? Like he was probably telling them, look, you're gonna have to kill me. Uh, this was going to happen. Like it has to be done. Uh, we don't know the reasons why, but I don't think Vanitas did it out of hate or out of spite or anything like that. Of course, I could be wrong. Uh, I just don't know where this anime is going to go, right? I, I really am loving the, the, the story that it's telling. Uh, so now with the introduction of my kill, Michael, uh, you know, it's a whole new world out there because it seems like we are going to learn about what happened in the past. And of course, we got that big cliffhanger of Noe feeding, uh, uh, feeding off of uh, Mike Hill. And now we're going to learn about the past. At the very least, we're going to see Mike Hill's memories. Like, what's his side of the story? We got to see Roland. Yeah, you rescued, uh, you know, him from uh, from whatever the vampire that was feeding on his mother. It's a really gruesome past, uh, but it's not going to get any better because as it turns Turns out we know that the doctor that's experimenting on the children is doing some really horrific stuff. Uh, and I don't know, man. I love Roland as a character, but I don't know. I don't know if I can forgive him because he's uh, if he knows what the doctor is doing and he's willingly getting children and giving it to him. That's messed up. That is messed up. Like that, I, I don't care how, how. That's messed up. Okay, especially since those are humans that he's supposed to be protecting, right? Like I, I can understand if you hate vampires to like, like, like absolutely to the most hateful thing ever, right? I understand. Whatever you know, you have a past with vampires. I can understand that. But if you're giving innocent children to the doctor to experiment on, and 
a lot of children i'm assuming died in those experiments bro uh you're just as bad as the vampires okay i'm sorry so i really hope that roland does not know about this uh and i don't know if whenever we had the little arc when Vanitas went to see the doctor uh you know roland was involved in that arc so i don't know if they actually said that he didn't know that the doctor was doing all of that i don't remember but i really hope that he did because uh man i love roland but damn what a what a character little twist uh what we have if roland turns out that he's a little you know he's a little evil in there right uh but yeah overall i mean this episode was great we learned a lot we're gonna learn a lot more in the future really really exciting times for the uh the case study of vanitas i'm excited for the future i'm telling you we better get a season two i don't know how much of the manga or the light novel the anime has adopted i don't know if we even have enough source material for like a season two uh but man this is truly uh greatness i i just love every episode more and more but yeah and also there's not gonna be a dragon quest video today because toy animation got hacked and they're not going to be releasing the episode today maybe next week but it's a bummer because it was supposed to be a great episode from what i've been told uh really sad news but uh hopefully they get all that stuff situated uh you know those hackers that did that that's messed up man but yeah overall the case study of anita's great episode let me know what you think in the comments and like always make sure to leave a like subscribe and i will see you on the next episode peace out boom